back to this edition of the Sherwood News Bulletin. We are back again with updates on all the activities and events that took place in the schools in the last month. From celebrating Republic Day to bidding goodbye to our beloved seniors, this month was truly eventful. Blessing the students and wishing them positive energy for their board exams has been a tradition at Sherwood Public School. On the 6th of February, a havan was performed to instill confidence and mentally prepare the students for the challenges that lie ahead. This year was a total fun fun fiesta with a lot of exciting activities and events. Throughout the year, we made marvelous memories with our seniors. From hosting events together to participating in the annual day. And oh, wait, who could forget the ISC trip to Varda? We will always cherish these memories in the years to come. After spending an amazing year and learning so much from each other, it was finally time to bid goodbye to our seniors. On the 6th of February, Class 11 organized a heartwarming farewell for the outgoing students of Class 12, the ISC batch of 2021 23. Lots of stories. Smiles, tears and congratulations were shared. Batch of 2021-23, may you fare well in all your future endeavors. It's time to update you on the Interact Hub activities of the month. The interactors of Sherwood Public School visited an old age home. They carried lunch packets, fruits and gifts for the elderly. Visiting an old age home was an eye-opening experience for the students. They got the opportunity to interact with the senior citizens, including one not eight year old. They shared memories from their life. The visit provided a great sense of empathy, understanding the difficulties and challenges the elderly face in twilight of their lives. It was an invaluable experience that will stay with the interactors for the rest of their lives. The next activity was a visit to a government school. It was a heartfelt and a happy experience. Interactors donated water tanks and biscuit packets to the young students of classes 1, 2 and 3. Former Sherwoodian Jay Mahita visited the school and conducted an interactive session for the students of class 11 talking about her life journey, the challenges she faced and how she overcame the hurdles that life threw her way. Mahita is a postdoctoral scientist at the Lajola Institute for Immunology in California, USA. Mahita did not let her hearing disability stop her from reaching great heights in life. She did not let people hold her back and has achieved great feats in life. Mahita also had an effective session with the teachers about creating awareness regarding early intervention of deaf children. The Constitution of India is not just a mere legal document but a reflection of our aspirations, principles and values as a nation. On the 26th of January, the whole school was filled with patriotic fervor. Our school organized various activities for students to indulge in. The day was celebrated with great zeal and enthusiasm with both students and teachers. The whole school assembled on the ground for the flag unfurling and paid respect to the country and to those who enabled us to freely live in it. The student gave speeches in different languages about the day and its importance. The students also indulged in class quizzes and put their thoughts on Republic day in form of art, cartoons, poems. Ah, okay, so jump out, jump in. The campus of Sherwood Public School presented a mystical evening on 5th February 2023 when the tiny tots of Akshar and classes 1 to 5 showcased their magical performances for the most awaited program of the year, the Primary Wing Annual Day. The dignitaries and parents were awestruck when they saw the teeny weeny Sherwoodians showcasing their talents confidently on their annual day. The program began with a group of children giving a warm welcome to the parents with a graceful classical dance. This was followed by some foot stomping dance numbers and a variety of songs by the time it also shared with They were filled with energy and joy. Their enthusiasm was infectious. The program continued with a showcase of talents starting from class 1 with their team Different Seasons in India. Next on stage was class 2 with their team Old is Gold. The students of class 3 showed their love and respect to our motherland with a dance on a mashup of patriotic songs. 
class 4 presented folk dances depicting the rich culture and heritage of a country. The students of class 3 and 4 presented a skit on the theme Every Child is Unique. Classes 4 and 5 sent a message about the importance of health and exercise through aerobics. Finally, it was time for the senior most class of Prime Living, class 5, to present a ballet on School Education is a Joyful Journey. Another highlight of the program was the choir. The children sang together in a perfect harmony, mesmerizing the audience. We look forward to many more fun-filled learning in the coming years. with more updates in the coming months. Till then, stay tuned and keep watching the Sherwood News Bulletin. Three, two, one. We look forward. <laughs> Visit an old age home. <laughs> Hello and welcome back to this edition. The day to five. This session for the the students also indulged. Uh, the students also indulged. Indulged. <laughs> <laughs>